Cameron Boyce died on July 6, 2019 at the age of 20 due to epileptic seizure. Alexa, when did Chuck Wick Bozeman die? Chadwick Boseman died on August 28, 2020 at the age of 43 years due to colon cancer. Alexa, who is Michelle Fighter? According to Wikipedia, Michelle Marie Pfeiffer is an American actress. Known for pursuing eclectic roles from a wide variety of film genres, she has frequently received acclaim for her versatile performances and is recognized as one of the most prolific actresses of the 1980s and 1990s. For his own domestic Alexa, that has who is Dan DeVito? According to Wikipedia, Daniel Michael DeVito Jr. is an American actor, comedian, director, producer, and screenwriter. He gained prominence for his portrayal of the taxi dispatcher Louis De Palma in the television series Taxi which won him a Golden Globe Award and an Emmy Award. He plays Frank Reynolds on the FX and FXX sitcom It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Democrats clearly divided. Give us Alexa, when did Christopher Lee die? Christopher Lee died on June 7, 2015 at the age of 93 years due to heart failure. Okay, over. Well, President Biden has been talking about that all day long on his first Western swing since taking office. Give and up. yes, he will be appearing here in Long Beach for that final rally, standing alongside on the eve of this historic recall election. Of course, the president will be Give urging up. Democrats and even independents, if they've not cast their ballots against the recall, to do so now. But Wolf, this visit all day long has been about so much more. President Biden has been making the case using California as Exhibit A with the wildfires and all the uh, crumbling infrastructure, why his Build Back Better plan, as he calls it, is needed in the Congress.